My desk is disgusting. After a long hiatus of not posting an actual video, I'm back with the videos that I don't even think anyone likes. A sit down video. This one is actually gonna be different from my regular ones because we are gonna be reading my old comic books. So the other day I was watching one of my older videos and in the video I was cleaning out my desk and I found these old comic books that I used to make in like third and fourth grade. And I basically said, let me know if you want me to read them. I didn't get any comments, but I'm gonna read them anyway, cause it's cold outside and I don't have anything to do. Right now I only have five, but I used to have so many. Also, when I read them, I want to have like a good angle so you can see it. And I think this might be the best one. There are people out front and I know for a fact they can see me through the window. Okay, I think I'm gonna start with, um... Earthquake and Time Stopper. Two original characters made by me. Okay, here is a good look at the cover. Okay, so I came to the realization that the GoPro footage is dog baskets. So I'm just gonna like take pictures of the pages and hopefully that looks good. Okay, so before I read this, I just wanna say most of them are pretty thin, like 20 pages. I don't, I don't think I'm gonna be reading this one that's 111 pages cause that's a lot of pages. So yeah, let's just dive right into Earthquake and Time Stopper. Meanwhile, in an office. Hey dude, you wanna rock climb later? By the way, prepare yourself for a lot of spelling mistakes. Example one, hey, ding ding, sweet. Haha, <laughs> you first. Oh, okay, so this guy right here is... This guy's like setting a rock on fire. And the two main characters, which we don't know their names yet, they are thinking about climbing this rock wall, this mountain. I'm so high. Same, bro. Here, take the ring. So an alien ship is just flying around, just just chilling, flying around, and it throws this ring out the window and causes the other guy to fall off the top of the mountain. Then his friend catches the ring while the other guy dies in the fire that the one guy was What? Wow. I like how I like how his friend just died and he's just like, wow. This ring stops time. Truly extraordinary. So he gets his friend out of the fire, he carries him, even though he's on fire. Then he tells him that the ring stops time. I have no clue how he'd know that the ring stops time, cause he just got it. His friend that was just burning is like, I should be good. Yawn, whoosh, cool. Whoosh, whoosh. You can fire bend. can you earth bend? I have no clue why I drew the two people literally the exact same. Like, there's nothing different between them. Cause you can't tell who has the fire powers and who has the ring. Like, this one guy is shooting fire out of his hand and I'm guessing that's the guy who was in the fire. Anyway, one of the guys can now shoot fire and earth bend. Um, meanwhile, time for my experiment. See, I spell stuff like experiment right, but I don't know how to spell bend. So basically, this man's cheeks just pop off of him and fly away out of his lab. This poison butt cream will do the trick. Why did my door just open? I think we're dealing with a phantom. Everyone used the butt cream and their butts came to life. Everyone's butts over the land were flying away. Meanwhile, the one guy can still fire and earth bend. So then one of the butts come and he's confused. I guess this is later. He says, hey dude, I'm making a suit. Want one? I have an idea. Sweet. I think that's illegal. Take this leader butt. Earth bend. What is a butts? And I want to ask you guys something. What do you think a butt's enemy is? P. Everybody knows that. <laughs> Bro, I don't want to say it, but this man is dummy thick. So yeah, he pees all over the flying butts, which kills them. Hooray for Earthquake and Time Stopper. Also, is that blood? So yeah, there is a taste of what might come in the future. Which one should I do next? I think I'm going to do this one. This next one is called Part 2. Oh, I don't have part one. Dang it, I don't have it. Okay, so I'm guessing Blue Bolt, who's the main hero, loses his powers. Basically pulls a Spider-Man 2. Um, also, I'm guessing this guy is the villain. He looks like Sandman. I think his name is like Cement Man or something. So yeah, let's get into it. 
Crime rates have significantly. I'm about to have a stroke. Crime rates have gone up significant, significantly ever since. Bro, the sadly disappearance of the New York's fastest hero, the Blue Bolt. Now would be a great time to have powers. The main crime source is a new supervillain who calls himself Sand Dune. Blue Bolt, if you're watching, then please come back. It's 12 o'clock already. I'm going to bed. Then he has a dream fighting Sand Dune. These dumb nightmares. <laughs> wow, my powers are back, but I can't control them. Zip. Ah. Crash. Crap. I gotta stop doing this. I like how this is just the normal thing. Like, I gotta, I gotta stop doing this. Meanwhile, wow. That's, wow, that's big. <laughs> easy, boy. Easy. I'm fine with ticks, but not giant ants. <laughs> it's fun to be small. Just get with the credits. The Tick Helps Blue Bolt Superhero Crossover Part 2. Crash. Ah, who are you? Ow. My name is Dempsey Ralph Dempsey. Okay. AKA the blue bolt, but I can't control my speed. You're an, you're an egg in the air. Can you build me a machine to help me control my powers? Okay, fine. Let me see your suit. Uh, sorta kinda threw it away. It's okay, you needed an upgrade anyway. Let's get started. What? I still don't have my powers. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you, you only have your speed when you really need it, and you have electricity powers all the time, but your powers only work when you're near another person with powers. One more thing, can you help me defeat a bad dude? Meanwhile, thanks for the suit. Yeah, uh, it's a uh, no, a uh, big deal. Can you please slow down? I haven't said it yet, but the tick is like Ant-Man. He can shrink and then he can grow again. And the super long book is the tick. It's like his own solo book. Suddenly, is this him blue? Yeah. Poosh. I'm really done now. Ugh. Now the tick's under there and he's too small. He's stuck. The tick seems to be in a pickle. He's crushed underneath Sand Dune's fist. Having a hard time. He can't get out. Grrr. So yeah, he can also grow like Ant-Man. Hey Tick, I have an idea. What is it? What happens when Sin turns hot? It turns to glass. Let's do it. Zap. He's glass now. And he's glass. I thought we already established that. You should join Hero Patrol. Bye. I'm pretty sure Hero Patrol was my version of the Avengers or Justice League. I think I'm gonna be done because this GoPro is freaking destroying my forehead. <laughs> I need help. Why would you ever tape your head?